Dumpsters, and I found this beauty lying there. I, well, I just wonder if you could tell me more about it. Well, obviously, um, do you mind if I? Yeah, sh yeah uh, if you look at the top, you can tell hey, that sir, this leather. Sir, no, to, no, this. Um, well, this is a different story entirely. This is going to be from the Pepsi company, obviously. Uh, you have the traditional Dr. Pepper logo. Which interesting is interestingly enough was not actually established until about three years ago. So this would wow. date this um, about so about 2010, 2011. Overall, so you know, we have um, it, it appears although it's it's empty that would dec that would um, lessen its value generally in this kind of market. Yeah, but the cap, seeing as that it's an empty bottle, the cap. Yes, the cap is what the real value is. I think, in my opinion. Can okay. you tell me more about the cap? Well, it looks like there's actually chewing gum in here. I would say juicy fruit. This is... Um, so that's going to raise the value, right? Definitely going to lower the value, Donovan. Mm -hmm. Well, I have a few concerns with this particular piece. Okay. Um, I looked on here. I tried to look on here for, like, ancient markings, and I found Egyptian runes. I don't know if it's... Carbonate? Ca water? Higahef? Carbon... Fructosy. Okay, so that'd be carbonated and fruit. These would be the ingredients, actually. Overall, Donovan, given the cash refund in California that's given on this, um, you're looking at about five cents. Um, is there any more questions that you have? I mean, how do you like how do you like being on the show? I can't. I can't believe it. You told me this is worth five cents. About five cents. Five cents? Uh, you yes. told me this is five cents? American, uh, it's American. Yeah! What's up? That's money. Yes! Glad five glad cents. Help you. Yeah. Five cents. Uh, be sure to tune in next week. Yeah! Take that, Obama. For the next, uh, perhaps the next, uh. Yeah! Sir, oh, I. Oh. Uh, Yeah, I quit. You heard me, I quit. I don't need you anymore. I don't need you anymore. I don't need you anymore. Oh. Oh. Hi, hi, please. All right, uh, looks like you got a treasure here. This is um, a treasure. Why don't you? Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about it? Okay, well, I first picked this up at the, um, at the Rite Aid. It's Babe Ruth's baseball bat. Okay, when was this? Okay, I was, this is flashback. This is in the beginning of our year, is 1942. Okay. Babe Ruth, okay? I'm just gonna stop, I'm just gonna... We're actually in the year 2015 right now, so I'm just a little off on where you from. When I was born. Okay, imagine yourself, 1942. There I was, a little tiger. Five cents! Yes, yes, yes. There I was. I was sitting in the out. I was. They told me not to go out onto the field, but I did. And you know what? When Babe Ruth hit his home run, his bat went flying. And then, guess who caught it? Me. I caught it. I even have a signature right here on the end. If you can, if you can kind of see that. Um, so that's actually the uh, it's actually the Rawlings signature. Who's um, that? There's going to be the Rawlings signature on any Rawlings bat. Um, that's not to say that this is a bad. But I have the receipt bat. from when I bought it off of him. Okay, so this would actually be a receipt for a for a Babe Ruth candy bar. But you see, when I found this in the trash can, I just thought maybe this is what I really need. This is my big break in life. So why don't you cut me some slack? Cover some slack, Jack. Okay, well, looking at this receipt, uh, it looks like you paid 89 cents for, for
for the Babe Ruth candy bar. Wow, no, but when my grandfather handed his bat down to me, I just couldn't be more proud. Why don't you take a better look at it? I'm gonna leave. Hello. Hi. Nice to meet you. This is a beauty. Yeah, it is. Um, this guitar, uh, my grandparents passed it down to me, and they said it was a Jimi Hendrix guitar. I was wondering what you could price this for. I don't know if it's real or not. I think you just check it out. Tell me the price. Okay. Well, uh, definitely a high quality guitar. Um, we're definitely, definitely seeing a lot less of these made these days with this kind yeah. of quality. Um, do you play this at all? I don't. I don't want to ruin the value. Okay. I was gonna say there's, there's, it's in very good order. Um, this actually could possibly be a Jimi Hendrix guitar makeup, which is not oh. a a guitar that Jimi Hendrix used, but it would be a makeup in the exact model, and there was about 13 of them made. Um, however, it would probably be worth about five bucks. Five dollars? Five bucks. Well, uh, in that case, I think you should just keep it. <sighs> I just keep it. Just, I just keep it. I mean, I don't play guitar, so. I mean, I mean, wow, fantastic. Right. You have a good night. Right, I'm gonna go, you. actually. Thank you very much. Like I said, absolute trash. It's just worthless. I'll be lucky if I can even get two dollars for it. I took in this Babe Ruth baseball bat. It turns out it's actually a Babe Ruth candy bar. Yeah, it was a good drive to get out of the house and everything, but... I mean, I didn't make any money, so just uh, just wait for another day, I guess. I came up here a thirsty man. I just so I drank a bottle of Dr. Pepper and I sold it for five cents. Yes, nickel, nickel. What? <laughs> nickel five cents. What? Oh uh, uh, yeah, I came in here, uh, you know, just doing my job, and uh, I ended up getting this uh, for free. Yeah, I'll probably turn a profit for this about eight. 8.5 million, Bob. Yes! Yeah, so pretty much uh, I bought my booth at the drugstore, but the drugstore, I caught the drugstore and I was in the outfield. Yeah, I just found out uh, I was scammed $8.5 million today. I'm going to be living on the streets. Ta! Gotcha! Yes! Five cents! I mean, yeah, I never have to work again. Um, I already have been talking to my agent. Uh, I just bought four mansions. Uh, that's done. I did that the past eight minutes. I mean, it's just fantastic. You know, it's just this one little guitar. I mean, literally the best day of my entire existence of all time. Yeah, so basically when my baby named Ruth was born, she, she was born with this candy bar. And I said, hey, is that candy bar is there and I went to the outfield and I caught the candy bar and basically it turns out I am Babe Ruth. This is mine. Five bucks. 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 Five buc